and we are back in the Minecraft adventure. We are back and we are going hard in the episodes here. We're going to be showing you a lot of the expansions that I've been doing. Don't want to turn around too quickly. Want to keep the tension up, keep the uh, suspense high and hopefully you'll enjoy what I've done since you were last here. This is the new house. This is the house. You'll remember it from the previous episode. We did a little bit of expanding. I've expanded a lot since then. I will take you on a tour of what I've done as well as carrying on this expansion. Uh, do leave a comment in the comment section if you want to see more of the actual expansion, what I've been doing, um, because I tend to just record it. Um, I don't tend to commentate when I'm doing it. I just sort of... Uh, go out my way, spend like two or three hours just mining away what I'm doing, other things, listening to podcasts, things like that. Just getting resources, mining out areas, the boring stuff that I don't think anyone really wants to see, of just mining the floors and things like that and sculpting out the area. Um, I'll show you a little bit of what I've done. I just run around the outside. Uh, I've expanded the, the outside so that we've got the three planks in the middle and I've changed that to the spruce wood planks from the oak wood planks that we had on the floor. Collected a lot of that as you can see and used a lot of it in here. Um, took a long time to do. Uh, secret way in. Um, I'm just going to walk around the top. Because we had this up to here uh, on the previous episodes. We had uh, out, we expanded out to here and we're deciding which way we were going to build. If we were going to build up, out or um, overhang on the outsides. Not Still not too sure what we're going to be doing upstairs. I don't want to show too much downstairs at the moment. We're going to run our way around the perimeter on the outside. There's going to be a lot of expanding that's going to be doing up as well. We're going to have uh, several floors high. It's a beautiful sun. Uh, I'm really liking this Chroma Hills texture pack. I know the guy that actually actually created it commented on the last video. So go and check it out if you want to. Um, his channel will be on a comment in the last video. So if you want to go and see that, just go check out the last video. And the comment will be on that. Still not too fluent in the keys, but I'm getting a bit better. Um, where are we going to head? We're going to head downstairs. As you can see from the entrance, it's uh, it's much different the entrance. We've still got this first room, but we've expanded it out onto the left and the right. This chest is actually blocking it at the moment, but I don't want to have to move all this stuff away yet. A lot of sugar cane that I managed to uh, stack up. As you can see, I've got some more here. Uh, I've got a sugar cane farm just over here. Oh, uh, run over and show you whereabouts it is. It is just down there, as you can see it goes all the way around the outside, if I can jump up here without too much hassle, I'll show you around the outside. It goes all the way around there, um, as you'll be able to see, let's do it. This is what we have around it, uh, we've got a lot of this, so I'm just leaving this to, to go up so we can get... Um, sugar uh, to make into bookcases and things like that into books and then into bookcases we also need to go and get some leather which I might go on a hunt for um, in the next couple of episodes we need to hunt for some leather so we can build the the area the uh, the enchanting area when we get up to the levels uh, as you can see I'm at level 26 at the moment just from mining out stuff I'm not sure what you think because this has just been a building phase uh, I'm not really going on any ventures yet so I might have to kill myself before then, um, take out all my stuff that I have collected up and my levels, uh, just so we can sort of get a fresh start once we've started building the house, we've finished building the house. But it's obviously going to be an expanding project throughout the whole thing, so just the basis I want there of a really nice, carefully crafted house. This frame of spruce wood planks goes into these, um, what are these, these birch, yeah, birch wood planks. Um, you go down into these double stairs, these triple stairs, with uh, actually a stair on either side that have come in. I think I like that effect of the spruce wood going down onto the floor. We've got spruce wood down the floor, and we go down there, and I'll show you in a second. This is our fir uh, storage area. A lot, as you can see, a lot of the cobblestone that I've had to sculpt out there. Nothing too much in there. Um, and in here we have one diamond. We've got some gold that I'm sort of saving up. Uh, just everything that I find around on my little travels. And in here we're cooking up some glass um, for some stuff that we're going to be doing. Thought I didn't have space for that then. Um, you'll be able to take all that. Perfect. Two stacks of 64 left. I might chuck that into this chest here, just so I don't forget. So I don't forget where I put it. Um, and over this way is going to probably be our master bedroom. Uh, I've not really got too many ideas of what I want to do in here. I'm using a stone pickaxe at the moment. I don't have much iron at all, so we're going to have to go on an iron run at some point. Uh, I'll make sure that I record that because that would be a little, little first adventure in a search for iron. And I've got a massive strip mine that I started to do, 
but I wasn't getting anywhere and it was a little difficult I need, think I need to brush up on a technique there uh, I'm not exactly sure what I'm going to be doing in this room uh, but there will be something I'm not sure what but I just wanted to sort of expand it out and um, we've got this direction for the house. In here is going to be the enchanting area. Uh, I've got the, like, the, just the base around it. We'll just put our bookshelves. I think I need to move one more in, don't I? I think I do. So we can have, yeah, I will need to move one more in. Not sure. Um, anyway, yeah, that's that room covered. Uh, and the master bedroom is going to be like that. And we're not exactly sure what I'm going to do in there. So if you have any other ideas of what I want to do in there, do leave a like, comment, and subscribe, um, as well as a comment saying what you want to see done in that room starts raining typical I absolutely hate the rain is it night yet pretty sure it's not just hate the noise no. let's move in uh, in this room right here it's a uh, it's a nice wooden area um, I like the lighting effect that I did in here with the the, uh, the little indentations on the room and uh, the torches on top of some fence posts. I think that looks quite tasty this room will be expanded in sort of more of a, a welcoming guest hallway sort of area and as we go down, I'm liking this little sort of like uh, running motif, if you will, of it narrowly going, getting narrower and narrower, going down, but still having these walkways that you can uh, make your way around. And probably having a nice big room over here that I could possibly link with the room upstairs if we want to have a sort of a double feature like that. So you can get down both ways. Um, and if we drop down, this is one way that you can get in. Obviously, the other way is exactly the same, uh, evenly spaced out on this side as well. So hopefully you do like what I've done here, and there'll be plenty more coming from this episode and these series. But this is a room where I sort of left it off uh, when I was mining out myself. Again, I'm not really sure what I want to do in the rooms. It's, uh, it's something that I sort of leave open to to whatever people really want to do, but you can never have too many storage rooms. So I might turn this one into another storage room or sort of... I was thinking an underground garden, and, and if, roll with me on this, um, I had a, a rooftop garden in one of my previous creations on the Xbox 360, I think that turned out really well. So I think with the PC version, I think I could really turn this into something very nice, very tasty little down here, and it would hopefully look very nice, and uh, I think I think it could, could do a good job for me, uh, as well as you know providing the, the resources that I need. Uh, in terms of wheat and things like that, sugar and carrots and things like that. And I think this could just turn into a downstairs farming area. Obviously, I could uh, do that on the levels that's going to be miles above that and have it sort of like running through and I could maybe see the garden from down here or something like that. Or maybe turning this into my sort of man cave area, um, turning it into a sort of a pit down here where I can put my pit pictures and things like that, just come and chill when I need to. Um, need to have a little break in my Minecraft adventures, just pop down here. So that, well, that's one uh, thing that I could have down here, sort of a man cave area, or a garden. I might move my garden to outside around this surrounding area outside, because that seems to be where most people have their gardens. Um, I can't say I'm surprised, considering you're not going to get too many grassy areas in people's houses, and people are not going to like that, unless they are growing a, uh, a certain type of plant that uh, um, might not be legal everywhere. So we're just going to be expanding around the areas, and thinking about what we're going to be doing in the rooms, and then our excavate the whole area I have a little plan in my head of what I want the area to look like um, I do like the fact that the ceilings are sort of the one below the the, the layer below uh, from the layer above sorry becomes the layer below's ceiling uh, I don't mind that at all so let's just grab this coal while we're here have I got space not interested in that what, I'm not sure now what's this below that's the wall downstairs isn't it the top of the wall downstairs. So that could lead below, it could, we could drop it down on a level if we feel like going into the master bedroom. But I want this to be an extravagant entrance. I want this to be something that people are going to remember as, as a monster part of... Uh, I don't have any pickaxes left. As a monster part of my uh, the Green Panda Adventures. I'm not exactly sure what I'm going to be calling it, but I do I do not mind this, uh, this character, this skin. It does look rather appetizing, rather tasty. Um, as you can see him on this one, he in his full glory. I don't have any armor for him or anything like that yet. Um, I'm not sure what that looks like on the uh, this texture pack, so we'll have to probably find that out in the future. Oh, I've got space for that, beautiful. Uh, I've got any more glass around here. Not. That was not the chest. Um, I've also got a dirt chest that I keep outside just because it's one of those things that I don't like having on me. Um, I don't like it cluttering up any of my space either. 
chuck this into that chest over there. I think I made it into a double chest, so I should have plenty of space. Yeah. This is my dirt chest. Um, I didn't, can't really think of many too, too many uses for dirt other than that. The garden area. Um, might have to do some landscaping myself. I'm just checking that there's nothing else. Nope. I can move those two that double chest over there, and I'll, I moved it away because all I need to do is move the, that cobblestone that I have in this chest over here down to the one below, and we'll be moving these area and cleaning up this area just basically what we've done, we're doing in this episode is cleaning the area making it more sleek and I'll expand the other ones offline while I'm listening to podcasts I tend to listen to PKA Woody's podcast really enjoyable why is there a snowball in there not sure but I threw it away I don't want that interfering with with my space uh, let's chop this down I'm gonna lose this in a second knew I was gonna do that we'll work our way through this with this chest pick up the double chest um, what have we got in here we've got sugar cane uh, move that on I wanted to get rid of these snowballs I haven't got any coal in here seriously I, I, I can't think of anything that I'd want to use snowballs for get rid of them uh, let's move them down I've got some apples I managed to collect a lot of apples on my travels I'm probably gonna expand out and around where was I gonna do this there was something I was gonna do there was something I was going to do for a crafting area, but I can't exactly remember where I was going to do it. It might have even been in here. This might have been the kitchen area, because obviously only, I've got the kitchen area in terms of that area. This area around here, which is just a cooking up area. I might have the... thing is, the crafting tables are going to want to be near near the chests and things like that. So I might have just a, sort of, a couple of double crafts there, a uh, crafting table on either side, so I can use that when I need to. Always good having a lot of furnaces about, uh, in case you need that. Probably be a food chest. I think sugar cane can go in with the food. Uh, I really should just put this chest here and dump all my stuff in it. That's what I'm going to do. Just so I can move all these next two double chests over. Obviously, I'm going to have to leave some of my stuff. Uh, I'll keep that on my hotbar. Just so I don't forget exactly what I have. Let's scroll over and take some stuff from this chest. Because this is really annoys me that I have to walk around it. I know where all this is going to go. And that can go somewhere. That can go somewhere. That can be the food one. And all of that will fit in. I'm not sure what to do with those pumpkins. But I love the texture pack. love the pick up picture on that. Might just put one on my head to see what it looks like. Absolutely amazing. Absolutely amazing. She's a bonnet to get some. Um, a lot of this stuff could probably go in here. I'm gonna move these around. Eggs can't necessarily go there. Seeds can go in with sugar cane, but I'm gonna move over that side. Saplings can also go around there. Got a lot of saplings. I tend to plant the, the saplings when I get them though just for the sake of moving them about. Uh, what else can go in there? Flint? No. Wing sack? No. Uh, what's in this one? Glass. Wool can go in with the glass. Uh, probably pumpkins can too. can keep all that on me. I don't know why I've got these flowers. They look absolutely disgusting on this texture pack. That's one thing I don't like about it is the, is the flowers. Um, I've got two extra bits of cobblestone. I might cook them up into a bit of smooth stone as well in case I want to need that. Just chuck them in there. Could have split that up a bit better, but I just didn't. Couldn't be bothered. Um, coal can go in there. Just anywhere. Well, I don't know why we even have that in there. Clay. Uh, it's obviously going to need to be need to be cooked up, so leave it in this chest. Yeah, I might need to put another that double chest that I, that chest I have over there and turn that into a double chest because I don't have like an armory. I might have a different separate place in my armory. That could be this room over here, couldn't it? I like the fact that I've still got this pumpkin on. Let's wait see what it looks like from the outside. Interesting. Very interesting face. Not exactly sure what he's doing with that on him. But let's move that out. Oops. Let's flip that round. I'm going to get all my stuff as well. Um, where did I put the pumpkin? The pumpkin's going in. No, this one. That's good. Um, let's chuck some torches in. Torches I don't even want to have in that chest. 
But I've got too much stuff now. I'm going to have to put it in one of these chests just for storage. It's going to have to be this one as well. For the moment, it's going to have to just stay down here. Stay there. And I'll take all this stuff back. I made some pressure plates by accident. I didn't actually want to make those pressure plates. I didn't have plenty of space. I don't know what I was doing. I'm going to take some of that stuff back then. Just because I don't want to have it just lying about in the place. Flowers. I fucking hate those flowers. We're going to probably sort out the garden in the next episode because it's something I want to get right. But I'm not exactly sure exactly the way I want to have it outside. And whether we're going to do any expanding outside. So that's the, bit of the, reason, the only reason I was sort of reluctant to do that. Don't have a pickaxe or an axe right now, so that's what we're probably gonna have to be finding. We might, um, obviously, I'm gonna need a hoe as well for the garden. Plenty of wood, which I luckily do have. Let's destroy this as well. Let's destroy everything around here. Got any space in my inventory? I have not, have I? Because I picked up those fucking stupid flowers. And the furnaces seem to take a while to destroy. Boom. One more. One more. I had a load of coal in it as well. Didn't even get the furnace, did I? Ink sacks, don't even need them. Um, I'm not going to need them. Felt like putting them on there. I'm going to want this crafting table though. And I'm going to want to move that bed. Um, at the moment I don't have a bed. I'm going to put, I'm gonna put my bed just there, just for the sake of it. Just have it somewhere. What's I going to do? crafting table out. I might keep this chest here, um, just for the sake of having a chest about. I'm going to need another space for another double chest, so we might have to... don't have a pickaxe, so I can't do anything right now. Uh, I'll probably store some chests in there, just store some shit in here. And I'll, yeah, this stuff I need to decide a place for it, and I need an armory. But when I have that stuff, a stone sword, I'm thinking, oh, I need an armory for that stone sword. <laughs> Not exactly sure what I'm doing with that. Let's check the saplings that I have in there. Anyway, this is these are the expansions that I have made. Um, I'm going to sleep through the bed, and we'll probably call it a day. Just, that's, I don't, I don't want to set my spawn there even. I don't want to set my spawn there even. Well, I'm waking up to a horrible area, so I'll probably just pop my bed down in this corner over here. Have a little sleep. You can only sleep at night. What time is it? It's, to be honest, it looked like night to me outside. It's just because it's absolutely horrible. It's just morning now as well. I've got a feeling. Let's pick up this stuff. Why not? But this is the house um, that I built. Jack did not build this. I built this house. And... Hopefully you do like it. Hopefully it's earned a sort of a like, a comment, and subscribe. Do share it with your friends as well. Um, hopefully you can get some more people supporting the series. I might sort this floor out once I get a, a pickaxe and things. Because I like to keep the spruce wood going along as the floorboards and the oak wood as the... Why have I got a gap in the ceiling? I'm going to fix that right now. That's annoyed me. can't believe I've got a gap in the ceiling. Ah, oh, it's because I moved the oak wood planks. I remember that now. It's this chest, isn't it? Cool, that was a poor placement. Don't even know what I'm doing. Let's take 64 glass, why not? Live a little. Um, shut that stuff, I don't know where to put in there. Spruce with slabs, I need to keep them on me probably. Plates can go in there. Just so we have a little bit of space in our inventory in case we pop along everything, anything that we want. I'm probably going to take down this as well. Probably expand it just so it's not so closed off. Feels horrible breaking glass now that I know that I don't get it back. We'll turn it just into the the other versions, but we can get rid of that dirt. Be dirt. Be dirt. Beautiful. I have to be get rid of that and put down some spruce wood. Because I think that's starting to come together a little bit. Be already spruce wood? No dirt. Be 
Already spruce wood, this one's definitely. Nah, I don't. Good effort. But I think this is yet yeah, uh, starting to look, come along nicely. Hopefully you do like what we've been doing here. I've spent a lot of time in it, so I really do appreciate the support. If you could like this episode, it would help me out. And I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.